Hey everyone, I just wanted to take a couple minutes to explain what you need to do for journal six this week. All right, so let's take a look here. One, nope, that one. All right. Um, so here for journal six, we are going to dabble a little bit with process analysis writing. It's just another type of rhetorical pattern um, that you might have to use um, at school or possibly even at your job. This particular type of writing um, can actually be used in the real world quite a bit because process analysis is explaining a process, right? Um, sometimes it's explaining how something works. Other times it's explaining literally the steps for how to do something. So if you can think in your workplace, that might be something that you're asked to do is, hey, can you, can you write up you know, uh, something that we can hang up on the wall that explains the, the steps you have to take to do this procedure or you know, what have you. That's pretty, that's pretty common actually. So we're gonna you know, just play around with that a little bit here in journal six. So if you look at the prompt, it says, how do you plan the perfect party or get together? It can be a birthday party, a bridal shower, a baby shower, a bachelor or a bachelorette party, a graduation party, an anniversary party, a holiday party, or just a gathering, maybe not something quite as big and formal as a party, something smaller on a smaller scale, but still something you have to plan for, like just a gathering at your house, a barbecue, um, a family reunion, just something, you know, can be a little smaller, but still something that requires a process, steps in order to get to that day, right? And that's what you're, you know, you want to think about the steps you take to make that event happen, right? So the guests, the location, supplies, food and drinks, entertainment, whatever else might go into planning this party or get together that you are choosing to discuss. Right. And you want to think, how would I explain to someone else how to go about planning an event like this? Take us through your steps. So that's what you're going to do here for journal six. Right. Um, it says set your timer for eight to 10 minutes and type nonstop, even if you go off topic. I think that, though, if you are giving me your process from start to finish, and explaining it, you don't want to just list it. It's not like one, two, three, four. You, it, it's you're still writing in sentence form, paragraph form. Um, explain, you know, if you say the first thing you need to do is um, decide on the location. Well, then tell me what kinds of things I need to think about when it comes to picking the location. Don't just give me first you do this, then you do that, next you do this. You know, explain each step as well. So think about the order of the steps. Make sure you have that in a logical order first, and then explain each step as you go through the process, right? So again, you can kind of choose whatever type of party or event or gathering that you're most comfortable with uh, and take me through your process for planning it, okay? All right, so try to have that in by Sunday night. If you have any questions or run into any problems, just let me know.